Another big part of my internship was the in-house events. Now, the events that I planned and executed were Pirates Weekend, Cars Days, Star Wars Weekend, um, Ninjago Weekend, our third birthday bash, and the Lego Club Weekend. Now, each event saw over 7,000 people in one weekend alone. And before each major event, there was a lot of preparation that had to go into each event. Um, one of the main things I got to do was press releases, a lot of advertising, making sure people know about the event, what's happening. Um, I really had to have good writing skills. I had to be able to pay attention to detail to not make any grammatical mistakes. I got to write press releases for three of the events that actually got sent out to press. Um, the other were written by our marketing assistant before he had left the company. Um, more event responsibilities was selection of activities, decorating the center. For our cars weekend, I covered the entire center with checkered flags. Um, my favorite event that I did was Star Wars weekend. Now, Star Wars weekend was the largest event in Legoland Discovery Center's history. We saw over 8,000 people in one weekend. Um, at each event, we had different activities that I had to come up with, which could be board games, it could be activities with the kids. Um, for Star Wars Weekend, we brought in the 501st Legion, which is a group of men who dress up as the Star Wars characters. They volunteered to do this, and we brought them in, and we would walk around the center. Um, the activity that I chose was a capture, where we would go choose a child, we'd ask him a trivia question. If he got it wrong, we'd keep asking him until he got it right, and then he got a prize. Each event was required to have a post-event summary. Um, this included su uh, success of the activities, and more importantly, what could be improved with the activities. Um, I had to go through 15-page promotion reports and decide which promotions were successful. Um, some of the promotions we did were in our store downstairs. If you purchased $50, you got a free keychain. If you purchased $100, you got a keychain and a poster and a free kit, things like that. So it was my job to determine what promotions were successful, which ones we should continue, and how we should modify them if they weren't very popular among our guests. For the, my future with the company, I plan on applying for the graduate program. It's called Accelerate. It's a Merlin program. Um, I might continue with the Legoland brand in Dallas and possibly Manchester. I would like to experience other branches throughout the world um, and obviously the potential of other continuation with Merlin brands.